Hello everyone, welcome back. Um, so I did finish the waves. I wasn't able to um, put that all, capture that all on video. Um, these waves, they do take a lot of time, and I've already explained the colors I've used. Um, and I'm just, it's just a matter of going with the flow, and uh, they kind of settle. So there, first, there's like a bit of a curvature going on. Okay, but now what we're going to do is we're going to work on the tree and we're going to add some lilacs right here and there. I've already started the sun, and that's just um, lamp black that I've used there. Okay, here I'll define those more. So, it's just... And the reason why I'm putting a bush here is just to kind of... Because this balcony is not really showing this deck here. So what that does is it says that there's something there. Okay. Now I'll probably in the future I'll do a video on just the waves because that is a lecture all on its own. Is the best take uh, time and it's just uh, uh, reinforcing the same thing over and over again so you get that effect there and that translucent Okay, so we're going to work on this tree here. I'm going to use this, um, it's called Iridescent Greenish Yellow. It's a really good color. Um, and because this tree is in a lot of light, it's going to be a very lit tree. So we're going to define those uh, barks by putting this highlight in there, okay? Just like that. And then I'm going to be reinforcing it with uh, the copper later on in the program. Now you see this here, the sand, I don't know if you could see it, uh, but basically when I was doing the sand, um, I brushed that by accident and it gave him the effect that, you know, some sand came on this tree, so I kind of kept that there and I just added more black here so it appears as though it's under uh, the sand. So by accident here, I... I also invested in a new brush. So basically a tree, it's kind of like a braid, so to speak. Um, and you can uh, just look at different trees in uh, near your area and then kind of see the details that take place in that tree. Every tree has its own kind of character. This one's almost like she's dancing in the sand. I would be too if I was in this exotic place, wouldn't you? <laughs> kind of reminds me of the song, Hands Up, the hippie Hands Up, Give Me Your Heart. I don't know if you guys know that song, but it's pretty outdated now. See how I'm doing that, and also you don't want to make it too straight 
because what it does is the, it's taking some of the rough edges of the canvas, which is what we want. Okay? And some of this black that I've already applied on there has dried, so it makes it easier to kind of highlight this tree. there because I'm going to just repeat this process over and over again but I want to show you um, how to do a lilac well it's kind of like a lilac uh, because this is a lilac tree now again as mentioned before I don't want to cover this area so I'm going to just put a few lilacs here uh, some there and uh, possibly some here and there this is not going to have too much and lilac. So all you do, uh, and let's see. Okay, so with purple and some white, titanium white. Okay, you're gonna start out here. We start with this part here. It's kind of like a star. Okay. But it's kind of like a leaning star, kind of like opening up a banana peel, okay, just like that. Okay, now that's the base coat, um, with some pink, okay, I'm going to add the highlight to that. quite small the image okay and from there I'm just gonna do some squiggly lines okay just like that all right you see and I'm just gonna repeat that process. I'm going to add some white in there, just to enhance it a little bit. Okay, so it's kind of like a braid you're doing. Okay, and then with some white, I'm going to go over that. Get some green in there, I'm going to off that. Some white to this pink. Okay, and we're going to do the same thing over and over. So, again, with the purple, I'm getting color blind here. We're just going to repeat the same thing we did earlier. Okay. Trying to lean so that my back is not covering the work here. This is Kind of my first video, so bear with me. Okay, uh, all right. So doing the same thing, so that kind of a banana peel. And just squiggly lines, kind of like a grape almost. 
but not quite. Okay. You want to add some curvature to that. See that? So, add some pink to that. I love spring. I uh, made here in Ottawa is a great, beautiful ambiance. It's just absolutely, just because of the lilacs, the flowers, we have the flower garden, Parliament Hill. It's just a wonderful time of year. It has other times too. Okay, so I'm just going to keep repeating that and then I'm going to go over it with some white later on till this.